I, I had the opportunity to um, research depression because you know I have a couple of friends who are going through it, and I first didn't realize they were depressed. I just realized they were off, right? You know, you talk to somebody and you notice they're off. And having starting to do some research around it, like you said, one of the things that I found was, you know, irritability. So really upset quickly, like just fly off the handle unnecessarily quickly. Isolation, wanting to be by yourself more often than typically you would in the past. Um, like you said, not liking things that you used to like to do before. Um, thinking that everything you do is wrong mm. or not correct or just not good enough, you know, uh, and being really overly critical of yourself. So when you see those things happening individually or at different times, sometimes it's not easy to put all the pieces together and say, this is depression. But when you go and do the research and you see that six, seven, eight, nine of those things are, you can attribute to the person, you're like, oh wow. It's depression. And again, in our communities, it's not something that we really do a good job of talking about and saying, yes, I'm depressed. Or, you know, we say, I don't want to claim it. Because if I claim it, then, you know, it's going to, it's already happening. Right? And so it's more about being able to address it. And I think that's really, really important. Um, and I really thank you for saying that because a lot of us don't really openly say it.